is. Look, today, Mike and I have been getting creative with these ice cube trays. Yes, there's definitely more to ice cube trays than just helping to keep your drinks chill. How about making chocolate-covered strawberries? Just fill the tray with melted chocolate, pop a berry into each slot, and then let it set. Beautiful. Agreed. <laughs> or you can pretend you're a master sushi roller by using an ice cube tray as a mould. Like this. Mm-mm. Good. Mm -hmm. yeah. Next time you make cookies, you can put half the cookie dough in ice cube trays and freeze them like we have here. Then the rest you can cook. And look, next time you want cookies, instead of having to make a huge batch, you just defrost them and bake them. Easy. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> and one last idea for you, making mini fruit popsicles. Put a banana slice or your favorite and your favorite berry into an ice cube tray. Fill the slots with your favorite juice, Toothpick, freeze, bing, go, boom, deliciousness mm -hmm. right there. Mm. Now, there are other things you can do apart from food, like I've used this ice cream <laughs> tray. <laughs> oh, no, no, I'm going to ice cream tray to store all my stationary bits and bobs. Look, nice little containers there, their own compartments. This one is used for a paint tray, so you don't get your um, paint mixed up when you get an arty farty. And look, if you go like this, you can mix them over here. Ooh, the options are endless, oh, everybody. Yes, that's mm. very cool. Get creative, these. see oh. if you can create something yourself. Mm -hmm. Penguins of Madagascar time, see you soon. Today, we Skype American boy band before you exit. We meet top young boxer Elizabeth White. And Chris and Guy are annoying the public again.